Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show you how to create beer with Blender. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and this is for beginner tutorial. So first one, click A, select all these objects and delete and go to add and mesh. Let's select here circle and press S, change scale. Let's go to object mode, change to edit mode or click top. Let's click F in keyboard. Okay, and press E for extrude and change extrude like this. Let's click I for inset and let's make inset like this. Click 1 for go to front view and click this icon and this icon for see inside. Click again E for extrude and extrude like this. Back to again normal perspective and click this icon and this icon select here for see normal model. Click this icon for select edges and control R. And let's hold left mouse at here one segment and click enter okay let's add one segment here let's control r again and let's make here one edge click enter okay let's again control r add here new edge click enter again control r Add here new edge and click enter and again control R let's add inside new edge click enter and again control R add new inside here click enter okay so in the same select this face mode and select this inside face and hold shift select this face okay and press i open inside and let's make inside here click enter again press i and change inset click again enter press i again change inset click enter again press i change inset and let's open inset face here we can change inset settings here click enter okay let's see nice so right now click session tool and back to object mode okay let's go to modifier go to add modifier and generate as you can see here subdivision surface let's select subdivision surface and change viewport layer 2 and render 2 Okay, and let's right mouse, shade smooth. Nice, very good. Click session tool and go to add, mesh and select tours. Okay, and let's change settings here, radius and minor radius. And let's move that up and move to right here and select this rotate tool. Hold left mouse and hold control for change rotation. Okay, so in this same, let's click one in numpad for change view and click this icon and this icon. Okay, click session tool and move the inside to cap. Press S, change scale, move the inside more like this. Okay, so let's go to edit mode and select this face selection and click this icon again select these face parts and delete select here face and let's select these faces and hold shift select this also and this and these parts and this and delete again select face okay so let's back to perspective and click this icon and this icon and let's back to object mode move to back okay and again back to edit mode let's press tab and select this edge selection let's hold alt click here for select these edges and hold shift alt select these edges and let's just press e 
for extrude. Okay, and press X for extrude X axis. Okay, so let's back to object mode and move the inside like this. Let's move the back a little bit. Nice. So select this torus and right mouse shade smooth. Very nice. And let's go to add meta ball and let's select here ball and move to up for smooth meta ball go to this icon and change resolution like this and let's copy these settings select render and control v for pass okay so in this time select this meta wall and shift d for duplicate and let's move to here again shift d move to here and let's move the blade a bit and move to the left again shift d click cancel and change direction like this again shift d for duplicate and move to here and left mouse again shift d move to here and move to right and let's put here this okay and press s change scale a little bit Again, Shift D, move to here. Again, Shift D, move to here. Change scale. Hold Control, select this ball and Shift D for duplicate. Move to here and change scale. Okay, and let's again select this with Hold Control and duplicate. Move to here. And again, Shift D, move to down, change scale, and move to here like this. Okay, not bad. And in this time, select this object, go to materials, this icon, and let's create new material. And first of all, let's go to render settings, change render engine cycles, and change device and denoise click this checkbox okay and let's click render icon okay let's click this icon for add environment image and let's click color select here environment texture and let's click here for open go to program files blender foundation blender 4 for here and data files studio lights world for example let's select this interior and click open image nice and back to render settings let's open here film and click for transparent background so select this object and go to again material and let's click surface let's use glass change roughness and change IOR let's change like this Okay, also select this part and let's use material 1 and click here for create new material select base color yellow or let's white Okay, change roughness Okay, so let's select this model and change color like this or let's use yellow and let's go to add mesh and cylinder back to this mode and change view click four okay let's click one and click this icon for see inside and change scale okay and let's we'll change scale a little bit to inside and back to preview like this in this time let's click this icon let's see okay and back to render mode and go to material and create new material let's use base color full yellow 
Okay, and select this cap layer. Change glass for C inside. Okay, not bad. And select this cylinder. Let's click this icon and create new material. Go to again, let's use glass and color change yellow like this for natural view and change IRR okay nice natural glass material so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck